Hi everyone, Bob Gold here. We're talking about words to lift by. As I mentioned before, in a time of COVID, with so much fear and anxiety, I don't know what to do. And so the only thing I know how to react is to, is to tell one person at a time how grateful I am, how blessed I am, to have you in my life. And that maybe by sharing a poem of appreciation, it might lift you up. And right now I think that's, that's what we need now, is we all need to have words to live by. And if you have another idea on what we ought to do, if you have someone you'd like to have recognized by me and my friend, the poet Ryan Ashley, please reach out to me and let me know. In the meanwhile, I want to celebrate someone who is extraordinary. I don't say that word lightly. There are many people I love, but this guy, this guy is truly extraordinary. His music background, he's practically, okay, I'm gonna use the word, maybe it's savant. He is so talented, he is so smart. He has become so technical. He is such a recognized leader. He has reinvented himself multiple times. And throughout every single occasion, he is always sharp, smart, articulate, knowledgeable, and caring. And I'm talking about Shelly Palmer. So Shelly, this today goes out to you for the amazing world-changing person you are and my small way of saying thank you. I'm here with Ryan Ashley. Ryan is a terrific poet. He's in North Carolina, Asheville. And if you need a poem, if you need words that you can't find to say and need someone to help you, Ryan is here for you. So Ryan, I've been telling you about Shelly Palmer, this technologist, and what are you working on? It, it looks ancient. Bob Gold, appreciate the plug. Um, you know, everything you had to say about Shelly kind of created a pretty easy platform for me to create this poem. Uh, but I was happy to do so using this beautiful 100-year-old Smith and Corona, pre-Smith, just Corona vintage typewriter that has probably seen more stories than any of us could imagine in our lifetime. And doing so with all your information, I have finished Shelley's poem. I'm just gonna add a little touch of flair with a classic ding and a rollout. And I want to show you the beautiful multicolor font that I used to create this poem. Just such beautiful imperfection on the ink. You know, every key is hit with intention, making a click, pressing against a ribbon. And we created a piece of art, a poem for Shelley, inspired by Bob Gold. Within any room you occupy, there is no way to deny that you wear the crown of an unmatched intellect, that you reflect with your thoughts, putting them down passionately into structured sounds that you masterfully sell. Yet you also hold in your soul that is full of so much music. It is as if your every breath is a piece of composed magic, blessing the earth with all of your gifts. Some wishes are not granted, yet the fight within your bloodline is seen in her fuel and force that keeps the fire burning. We continue to learn as we go, but you should know that you are seen for all the brilliance you are. And through gold eyes, it is an honor for him to be by your side. Thank you, Ryan. Yes. Shelly, for you, your wonderful family, the world that you create, the world that your sons create, we are better for it. Until next time, I hope you enjoy these words to lift by.